there. Welcome to Inside the Caribbean. I'm Hugh Johnson. On the program today, I'm going to talk about three important things that you must know before you head down to the Caribbean for your special vacation, and especially if you're going to the Caribbean for the very first time. I'm an island girl myself, so I have the inside scoop. Number one, uh, the Caribbean is also called the West Indies, and it's a multiplicity of islands, 28 and counting. There are diverse cultures, diverse languages. You'll also encounter a diversity of peoples, from the Indians that had arrived there as indentured laborers, and they populate islands like Trinidad and Tobago and Guyana. And there are Europeans, the Africans. And so no one uh, Caribbean island is the same. So make sure you take your pick and always return to experience another aspect of the Caribbean. Number two, just because we're mostly recognized for tourism, and we are also celebrate tourism. Tourism is not the biggest thing in some of the islands. For example, Trinidad and, and Tobago, they prefer to talk about oil and gas. In fact, they do export oil to the United States. For the Cayman Islands, it's finance. In fact, the Cayman Islands is one of the most important financial centers in the entire world. The top 100 banks in the world all have a presence in the Cayman Islands. And thirdly, I leave you with a fun fact about the Caribbean, which may surprise you. Despite the fact that we have some of the best beaches in the world, hundreds of rivers and lakes, we can't swim. We don't swim, <laughs> and most of the time, we don't want to even learn how to swim. And I can speak for that because I cannot swim to save my life. Hopefully, at some point, we can talk to someone who can, Jamaican Olympic swimmer, Alia Atkinson. Atkinson swam her way into the record books by becoming the first black woman to win an international swimming title and the first Jamaican to win gold in the pool. I am Hugh Johnson. Until next time, as we say in the islands, walk earth.